Hi guys, James here from Elite Outdoor Gear. Today we're just going to have a quick look at one of probably our favorite Spyderco knives, the Tenacious in black. And we're just going to do a quick unboxing and go through some of the features and specs of this knife. So here's the Spyderco Tenacious. This is the box that all, pretty much all the Spyderco knives come in. You've got your, your packaging, a few details on the outside. Um, just slide straight out. So in the package you get your Spyderco knife and you also get your Spyderco warranty card information pack just just how to look after your knife um, and a few other little details in there as well so you get your full set of instructions. So Spyderco, anybody that's familiar with Spyderco, uh, it's got the classic round circle in the blade, so it's one-handed opening, very useful if you're trying to open with one hand, if you're trying to do something, hold it with the other hand. Spyderco are very good at um, the blade, the, the action on this blade is really, really nice, so it comes out very easily. So from opening to closing the knife, it's as simple as that. A uh, couple of features with the knife. So the blade, the steel that they use on this knife is called 8CR13MOV. It's a stainless but it's a very hard stainless. So it's a very durable steel. Once you get it sharp it's going to hold an edge really really well. Uh, the blade length on this knife is 86 millimeters and it's got that non-reflective black coating finish on there so it's not going to shine or anything like that and it's also going to protect the blade a little bit. Um, it's got on the back of the blade, if you can see here, it's got this jimping here. This is another really good feature with the Spydercos. They look a little bit different. They kind of, they almost look like an animal when you look at them from the side. It's almost like a little skull or a head or something. But it makes for a very usable, when, you, when you're actually cutting something or cutting heavy, or doing heavy work with it, it makes for a very, very usable blade. You get a very, very good grip here with your thumb on the back with this jimping. So that's the, you can see it's got a bit of a grip to it on the back, the jimping. So you can hold it quite firmly. Um, handle, you've got your G10, which is extremely hard and durable. Uh, it's got a fairly good grip. It's not, the heavy, it's not the deepest of G10 grips that we've seen, but it's still, I mean, if it's wet or dirty or whatever, you're still gonna get a really good purchase on it. Very hard and durable, the G10 scales. Uh, the overall length of the handle is 113 millimeters. Uh, and also the overall length of the knife from back to spine you're looking at 197 millimeters. Now the weight of the knife comes in at about 120 grams, so it's 117 grams to be exact for this knife, so nice and light, not a, not a super heavy knife, but it is quite durable. Um, it's got the liner lock built into it, so as, as you're using, like anybody familiar with Spyderco is going to um, no, the liner lock, so it won't close on your fingers. So as I'm opening and closing it, I'm using my thumb just to push that liner lock away from the blade, then you can open and close it, but otherwise during use it's not going to close. Uh, Spyderco also offer a lifetime warranty uh, against defective workmanship with all their knives, so they're just, yeah, they really stand by their products, they make a really, really good item. Um, this particular one it's not tiny and it's not it's not their biggest knife either. This is a really, really good pocket carry. It's a good working knife, good mix between something you could probably carry every day and also heavy enough to do a good bit of work with it. It's also got a deep, I'm just gonna show you, you've got a reversible po pocket clip here. This is quite cool. So you can see the pocket clip here. It's not full deep carry. So we'll sit out of your pocket by maybe eight to 10 millimeters. I'm just gonna try and get that on the camera. You can see the pocket clip finishes here. So this little part of the knife will probably stick out a little bit. The pocket clip is reversible. You can actually put the pocket clip at the back of the knife as well. So you can have it going the other way around. And you can also, um, you can also put it at the back. So you've got a few options for changing that pocket clip for where you want it to sit. <laughs> So there's not really much more to say about it. It's a really, really good working knife, very durable. Like all the Spyderco products, high quality, the action, the movement and everything is super smooth. So that's it, 
opening and closing is an absolute breeze. I love the Spyderco products. Uh, they do look, when you, when you see Spyderco blades for the first time, they do look a little bit different, but anybody that's used a Spyderco fork knows how functional they actually are. Um, if you have any other questions or if there's anything we've missed in this video you need to know any more about this knife can you please leave it in the comments below or alternatively you can email us and we'll try to answer those as quickly as we possibly can uh, also if there's any other content you like if you got any ideas if there's something we sell on our website and you want a video for it please email us let us know we can definitely look into doing something for that also if you can like and subscribe below if you do like our content um, we try to be as as informative as we possibly can with knives and give you the sort of ins and outs of them. If you do like our content, which will come out every week, please like and subscribe as it helps our channel. So yeah, that is the Spyderco Tenacious with Plain Blade.